Hi friends, welcome, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today's video, I am going to just kind of hop right in and kind of start chatting with you guys and just start talking about my 2024 Hobonichi weeks here. I am super excited to show you guys. Well, obviously nothing has changed since the last time I showed you guys, but I'm just excited to kind of go over it. I want to do like a little bit of a setup. I want to put some tabs down and I'm kind of like having a hard decision which tabs I want to stick down. I also want to lay down washi tapes and then also put my monthly stickers down. Um, and then also show you guys how I'm going to redate all of January or all of December's 2024 in this calendar and um, explain it a little bit better, hopefully. And then that way you guys can see how I'm going to start this planner starting October 16th and then be able to start it on its regular time schedule and not miss any pages um, for next year. Because like I said, this planner I started last year and... Um, because I started it early, I have no more weeks in there um, besides the back pages, which actually never get used because you because um, I'm pretty sure everybody, well, I shouldn't say everybody, but a majority of you guys start um, your Hobonichi week starting the first week of December. And because of that, you always have these blank back pages back here that never get used. And I'm like, why don't I use that? I don't know if anybody has come up with this before or if someone else did it, but from my knowledge, I know that um, I haven't seen anyone use those back pages before. So, you know, I'm not saying like, oh my gosh, this is my idea or whatever. It just dawned on me that I could do that. So that's why I'm like, oh, I'm so excited because I never seen it myself. Um, but if you guys have seen it, I'm pretty sure you're going to be like, oh, I already seen that before. But to me, it's new. Um, but yeah, so let me just go ahead and get started. So, um... Let's talk about how I'm going to start this for this planner starting on January or not. Oh my gosh, you guys, my, okay, Keish, get it together. <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to be able to start, um, October 16th. So like I said, you never use the back pages. There's about five weeks. Well, this year, last year, I only have five weeks worth in the back of this planner. So I have one, two, three, four, five. So I have five weeks that I'm not even going to use. I mean, I'm probably going to use it until I get to October 16th and then I'll be able to hop into this one. But for this year, um, for the 2024's planner, next year, um, I'm going to be able to use six weeks worth of planning in here early. So... And you're probably like, okay, Keisha, how, how are you making that make sense, you know? So this planner is going to start on the first week of December, like every single Hobonichi weeks. Um, you start on November 27th to December 3rd, and then that's when your planner originally starts. Um, but my thing is, like I said, you don't use these back pages here because you're already in a brand new Hobonichi weeks by next December of 2024. So more than likely, this is the first week. Um, same thing here, just like I said. Um, so see, so here's November, 2023, the 27th to the third. This is November, 2024. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, you can kind of see it a little bit. Let me show you. So there's November, 2023 and there's November, 2024. So this is the week that the new Hobonichi weeks will be starting more than likely because again, it starts on the, the first week of December and the first week of December is going to fall on a Sunday. Um, so more than likely, this is when the first week of December is going to, or the planner, the Hobonichi weeks is going to start. So because of that, I'm going to go ahead and redate all of this. I am going to go ahead and just white out these, this um, section here. And then also white out the dates here. I have a bunch of date covers. I have a bunch of stuff that I can use to like lay down here and then just redate it. Um, it's very, very similar to how I was able to redate it here. Just like this, I have a bunch of numbers, stickers that I can use. Um, so I'm just gonna redate it just like this. And um, so this week it's gonna be October 16th to the 22nd is when I'll start it. And then the following week is going to be October 23rd to the 29th. And then October 30th to November 5th. November 6th to the 12th. 
November 13th to the 19th, and then November 20th to the 26th. And then, because it ends on Sunday the 26th, that's when I'm going to go ahead and flip back to the beginning and start November 27th to December 3rd. And then I'll be able to use the whole entire year without missing any pages. Um, because like I said, my 2023 planner, is like totally jacked up and I have to figure out a way to like plan in it still. Um, because I started it all the way early. Like I literally started it, um, I think it was this week here in the middle of September. And I use this whole bulk of pages here. Well, actually without this one, I used this whole bulk of pages and that was just super, it's now that I'm like in that weird process of like trying to figure out how I'm going to plan in here going forward and to last me until I start this new one. Um, I don't want that again. Like I said on my, my like, like my last two videos, I don't want that awkward starting time. And then this time next year, I'm going to be stuck in a rut. Like, oh my goodness. Okay. I have to figure it out again. Just like I did my, with my 2023, but with this, um, this way, I'm going to be able to start it early and not miss out on any of the weeks um, going forward from there. So I'm super excited. Um, I hope that kind of describes what I'm talking about a little bit. Um, it might be easier to see like once I like redate it and lay down stickers and like white out things and then you guys will be like, okay, I see it better. Um, but yeah, I mean, like I said, if you guys want, you guys can stop it and then see, I kind of already marked them on my notes pages or on my pages here. So like the 48th week of November, 2024, it's going to start October 16th to the 22nd. So then that way it's kind of easier for you. So if you're like me and you want to start it early and you didn't know how, that is how I'm going to do it. Um, don't blame me though, guys, just so you know, if I'm wrong about when the 2024 Hobonichi weeks is going to start, but more than likely I know that I'm right because like I said, it always starts the first week of December and December is going to start on a Sunday. So more than likely it's going to start this week and I'm just going to hold faith that it is. Um, and if it's not, then it's just one week that I'm missing, which really isn't that bad, but I highly doubt it. I know it's going to start this week. Um, but yeah, so I am, see, look, the 48th week, and this is the 48th week of 20, so 48th week of 2023, 48th week of 2024. So I know that it's going to start here. Um, but yeah, so that is what I wanted to kind of go over with you guys, because I know on my setup video, I was kind of like blabber mouthing and kind of confusing about what I was saying, but I feel like being able to show you guys you know, the week of December, 2024 and like the dates that I'm going to lay down. I feel like that is more, um, how would you say it? It's more, um, I, it's, I don't know. I don't know the word for it right now. I don't know why I'm totally blanking on the word, but yeah, it's just more, you're able to view it. And I don't know. Anyways, guys, I don't, apparently I can't find the words for it, but that is how I'm going to start this planner early. But for now, I don't want to do that because it's like in four weeks, so I can start that whenever, but I actually wanted to come on here as well and then lay down like washi tapes and stickers and da 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 da. So I'm going to go ahead and lay down all of my washi tapes. I have all of these. These are all from Planner Monkey Co. And if you guys didn't know, which I'm sure a, mo a majority of you guys do, I do PR for Planner Monkey Co. Um, I have a code Quiche15 that you can use to save at her shop. But these are all the washi tapes that I want to use inside of my Hobonichi right now. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and lay them down here like on the side. And then I am just going to go ahead and layer it. Whoopsie, I actually need that one because that's December. I'm gonna go ahead and layer it with um, with her stickers too as well from Planner Monkey Go. And then I'll just kind of lay it down on top of it. So, but yeah. But I don't know why guys, like all of a sudden, obviously like Hobonichi season gets you excited and you're like, oh my goodness, I can't wait to get a new planner. And that's how I feel right now. Like I wasn't really feeling this planner because I gravitated more towards my commit 30.
But after, you know, getting set up and feeling like I have a game plan about what I want to do. I don't know why I'm even doing it that way. I can't even see it that way. Um, I feel like I have uh, more excitement about picking up this planner again. I do really miss it and I miss like the portability of it. So yeah, I just, I'm so excited to start it again. I'm so ready to start it and just start fresh and start new. And yeah, I'm just super excited. Um, I do have a washi tape that I need to go get. Um, I got an order just literally in the waiting for me in the mailbox that got delivered yesterday from Planner Monkey Co. And it's like um, new washi tapes or like two new washi tapes and like a couple of stickers that I got for like Halloween. I'm actually going to stick it up here. My husband's watching my son and he's trying to like keep him out of the room because I'm trying to film and he's so funny. So that is how I'm going to lay it down for now. I like that. And then January, I'm going to use this pretty blue one. I don't ever put anything here on the sides. So it doesn't really bother me that I'm covering it up. Um, yeah, I don't. We just got back home. We went out all day. Well, it feels like all day. I think it's, I don't even know what time it is right now. But we went out and ran some errands. Um, went out for breakfast this morning. And yeah, let's see what time is it. It's 2.57. And like I said, we were gone. It feels like all day. I think we left around like 8 o'clock this morning. And we really got home. And I'm like so beat. And then um, where we live, they're having like a little barbecue thing. And my husband was so funny. He was like, I'm going to go over there and get something. So I'm like, okay, have fun. I'm like, I did enough socializing today. <laughs> like, I don't even want to socialize anymore. So I'm, I'm good. <laughs> He's like, really? You're really not going to go? And I'm like, no, I am done. Like, I don't even want to go anywhere. So him and my son went over there. And they're back now, obviously. But they're having like like burgers and hot dogs and like just the whole um, cookout thing. And we didn't even know what was going on too. And then we got an email from, from them and they were like, oh, come join us for some food. And my son and my husband took advantage of it. And I'm like, nope, I'm, I'm good here. There's nothing more therapeutic than sitting here and just, just being in your own element here. And I'm like, oh, I needed this. I needed this. I needed this. Here comes my son. <laughs> oh no, he's not actually. Oh my goodness, I don't even know why he couldn't come in. I didn't lock the door. I just closed it. Uh oh. Maybe it's stuck. But my, they're watching football right now. And I'm like, you guys have fun. I think I'm going to do this every weekend. Because this feels so nice to sit here and just have a little bit of me time. Like I said, they always want my attention 24-7. And if I'm able to sit here and just get a little bit of planning done here on camera with you guys... That is amazing. Oops. Oopsie, it's a little crooked, but I'll just fix it down here instead. There we go. Oh my goodness, that is looking so cute already. December, January, February, and March. Perfect. And then April, my birthday month. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it's already. It's crazy to think, like, I was calculating, or um, when I was, like, doing the the pages of, like, how many weeks I can back plan in it, because I think um, it's, like, 
anyways, um, I was basically like counting up the weeks and stuff like that until this planner would technically start, which is like I said, the first week of December. And I was like, oh my goodness, is it really only like nine weeks? Maybe even less now, I don't even remember, but oh my gosh, it's only like nine weeks until December. And I'm like, where did 2023 go? Like, that is insane, like insane. I'm still shocked that, that we are already here, that's crazy. And then May, I'm gonna stick this one down. I love Planner Monkey Co's washi tape. I could literally get every single one. I think I literally have every single one that she has. And like the washi tape that I just showed you guys is not even like all of it. I still have more and I still have two more in the mailbox. Um, like I still have these two that are still on here. I still have like four more on this little washi tape stand. And I have a whole little bag like full of a majority of them. I think like two of them or some, this one and this one and this one. These three are the only ones that aren't Planner Monkey Co. Actually, just kidding, there's more. This is not Planner Monkey Co. This one isn't either and this one isn't either. But all of those in there are Planner Monkey Co. And the ones that I'm showing you right now are Planner Monkey Co. I absolutely love her shop. I feel like her shop is very uh, versatile when it comes to your planning style. She has minimal, she has colorful, and even like with her main character, Macy, I feel like she, she has so many, um, sticker options that don't include Macy and then other ones that do include her and not just that, but she also has different characters and I just, I genuinely enjoy Planner Monkey Co's, um, shop like literally the best in my opinion it's the best and I'm not trying to like you know obviously promote my my code or anything but you know when you really love something like it's the fact that I really enjoy her shop and I get to promote it and tell people like how good it is I think that's so cool I always tell her like like I'm always like I will be on this PR team as long as I can like I will continue to apply and be on this PR team as long as you let me like I legit will I'm not even kidding <laughs> okay and then this is July actually no let me use this one for July I'll probably go check the mail here pretty soon and then go get my new washi tape and lay it down. So we're gonna skip October's washi because I don't have that one. I keep forgetting that I have it in the mail. And we drove by it and I'm like, oh no, I'm supposed to go get my washi tape, the mailbox, and I still didn't even stop. <laughs> it's too hot outside. And I'm like, today's supposed to be the first day of fall. What in the world is going on here? I think the only forward planning that I'm going to do is things that are like birthdays and um, anniversaries and et cetera, et cetera. July and then August. Wait a minute. I think I'm confused on what I'm doing. Did I do this right? I feel like I have one too many washi tapes. So I have December, January, February, March, April. May, June, July. Okay, apparently I am fine. Now, which one do I want to use for August? Hmm, I'm going to use this book one. I love this washi tape. This book one is my favorite. September. I'm gonna use this one for September. This is like all the cozy vibes. I was gonna use this like um 
buffalo plaid one, but I'm like, that looks more like November colors and I can like put pumpkins and like different stickers like that. Um, right here. I feel like this is more September because we have all the cozy vibes all of September, even though it's still freaking hot outside. <laughs> September. Okay. There's October. This one, like I said, I'm gonna skip because I need to go get my new washi tape and I have um, a cute washi tape. Oh, which by the way, I shouldn't have used this one <gasps> because the one that I have is October and it's literally the same washi tape, but the Halloween colors. I have another Halloween one too. I might take, pick this one up. And if I decide I still want the book one with the Halloween colors, I'll do it too. So it don't matter. I can have a repeat of it. I love that washi tape. So I don't know why I have Taylor Swift's um, August song stuck in my head right now. Probably because I say in the month of August and then all of a sudden I'm like, August was the week until the moment in time. It was never mine. I better stop. And I can't see a <laughs> Oh my goodness, Keisha, stop it. You are cringe worthy. Mm -hmm. okay and then this is december but i'll be in my new planner by then so i'm not even gonna worry about that um and now that i'm thinking about it you're probably like uh keisha how are you gonna do the month of october and november um i will more than likely just do the same thing that i did this this time last year which is here oh no just kidding i started it over here so I will pour probably more than likely use the extra months because this is March of 2025 and we ain't even thinking about March of 2025 yet um, I can do October November I can do October and February and then November and March and then just flip back to the beginning again just like how I did with this one so here I so because last year in my 2023 I started in September so I went ahead and started it December 2023, technically started it here. Um, and then I did October and then November. And then I went ahead and covered up this page because I wanted extra deco in there. Um, and then once I was done with that, once I was done with these pages back here, I just flipped back to the beginning. Um, here, there's December. Of 2022 so once that happens actually let me make a little note here so then that way I can just I don't know if I want to use this page again to put deco in here I might but I don't know we'll see but for now that's what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna redate it and then start it again so I'll redate one of these extra pages here these months um, for two months and then I'll just flip back to the beginning again and then start it all over so that's how I am going to do it inside of my 2023 and then I am going to go ahead and put some tabs on now but I don't know which one I want to start I don't know I don't know I don't know these are both really cute colors so I don't know which one I want to do. Let's see. Do I want these little ones, which are cute? And they kind of poke out a little bit. Or do I want these bigger ones? Uh, I might do these ones, actually. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. 
I'm kind of feeling the little tabs, but at the same time, I kind of like the bigger ones. But I also feel like the bigger ones are too much, and I already had that last year. I mean, they're not as big as these ones from Shine Sticker, but I want something that's like smaller. So I think I'm gonna do this one here. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So this is December. So I'll go ahead and get December. And I will just go ahead and start sticking it on here. Because they're small, I'm probably going to stay within these lines here. If I can, and if not, then oh well. Hmm. I'll probably speed up this part because I don't want to be sitting here forever. And you guys are like, oh, you are taking too long, Keisha. Cute. Is that poking out? Oh, yes. Look at that. That is freaking adorable. It's so tiny. If I don't like it, then I can always peel it off because believe me, I have plenty of these um, tab stickers. Where is that? I have quite a few. Uh oh. Nope. It's somewhere. Somewhere lost in the sauce in here. Oh my gosh, it's going to bug me that I can't. Oh, right here. See, I have literally two more. So I'm like, it's fine. Okay, so there's December. And then we'll go to January. I don't even know where this one is at. Mm, oh, well. I don't even know guys <laughs> we are just doing the best we can with everything how much pokes out anyways oh quite a bit actually like right there right there These tabs, or is anybody else like me? These tabs give me anxiety. Because I'm like, oh jeez. Let's see right there. Okay, it is what it is. Oh yeah, that is adorable. Okay, now February. Even if it runs up short, it's fine. It's fine. We are not going for perfection here. We are just swimming along. About right. I was about ready to say, like, my son, he says, right there, right there. And then he says, good job, mom, good job. <laughs> you guys will definitely not get my son this video. Well, so far you're not. Oh, wait, that one's a little crooked. Whatever. February. And then we gotta go to March. There's March. Yep. Right there, mom. Right there. Good job, mom. Good job. I may or may not make me another coffee here pretty soon, too. May or may not. May or may not. Uh, March. Perfect. And then now... April 1st. I should have got me another coffee before we came home. 
or even oh my gosh it's so bad you guys but i have been well we actually i should say we we have been so addicted to not really addicted but like we've been wanting it more is um i don't know if you guys ever heard of uh, obviously some of you guys know dutch brothers and uh, some others don't but um, it's a coffee shop here and there's, they have plenty of like branches and stuff, but I don't know if they have them like everywhere all over the U S but, um, the rebels, they have these energy drink, um, drinks that like, they like put their sauce and like different kind of flavors in. <sighs> it is so good. It is so, so good. I am in love with, um, they had this one. It was kind of like a seasonal one. It was for 4th of July and it was called like the Firecracker Rebel. And because I love it so much, I asked the guy, I'm like, you know, um, when I, when I asked for the Firecracker now, they're like, we no longer have that. So now all, but I told them like, well, what's the main, like, um, the main like syrup. And he was like, oh, it's, um, red raspberry. So now I just asked them for a red raspberry rebel. And the only thing that's missing is like the little sprinkles that they would put on top of it. And I'm like, that's fine. I don't, really don't need that. Um, but yeah, and it's so freaking good. It is so good. Wait, did I do this right? I don't know. Yeah, I did. Okay. And it's so good, you guys. I love it it's an ice red raspberry rebel and it is so good and then now a new one that we have really really recently tried it's for their um like fall menu it's like halloween fall menu um it's called vampire slayer and it's so good too that one is a pomegranate and strawberry rebel so good as well so if you haven't tried it, be sure to try it. It is an not blended, iced. I feel like the blended. Okay, sorry guys. My brother called me and he never calls me, <laughs> my little brother. So I was like, huh, he's calling me. What is he calling me for on uh, July 1st? So I answered it and he's like, what bug spray do you guys usually get? Like, <laughs> he's all the way back in Arizona. And he's asking what bug spray we normally got. That was really, really good to spray. And like the one that my husband recommends. And it was just funny because they're, they're funny. My brothers are funny. Okay, I'm like, I was totally on a roll. And now I'm like confused. Okay, July, uh, June 1st. Perfect. And then all the way to July now. July 1st, okay. But yeah, they're hilarious. And then now, what was I talking about before? I think I was talking about Dutch Brothers. <laughs> I might convince my husband to take us back because it's not too far from us. But yeah, I really recommend it. So you would just get an iced um, Red Raspberry Rebel or also a... Um, Vampire Slayer, an Ice Vampire Slayer, August. D and don't get the blended one. I mean, obviously if you want the blended, I'm not saying like, don't get it, but I don't like when drinks are supposed to be carbonated and they're flat, like, ugh, it's just like my pet peeve is flat drinks, anything, soda, sparkling water, mm-mm. If it's supposed to be carbonated, I want to feel that burn. <laughs> okay, wait a minute. August, yeah, there we go. I don't know why I'm like getting confused here. All right, and then September 1st is here. So I got this sticker. Yeah, I'm gonna fall short, but oh well. Oh well, oh well, it's fine. Do, 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 do. That should be good. September. And then, oh, it's kind of crooked. Stop being a perfectionist. 
I keep saying like, oh, I don't care. I don't care. It's kind of like crooked. And then it like slowly irks me just a little bit. Just a little bit. But I'm like, just move on, Keisha. It's not that serious. I don't know if I like how far they're sticking out, but we shall see. As long as the front cover is like kind of covering it a little bit, it's fine. There's October. And we're gonna go straight into November. November 1st is right here. Okay guys, there's my tabs. I really like how they came out. Let's see. The front cover. Oh yeah, the front cover is covering it a little bit. So, let's see. They look super cute. Okay, I want to put a paper clip here too. I actually have one in here. Let me get it out of my personal rings planner. Here it is. I had it over this vellum. I kind of want to take this vellum out because I really like it. But I don't know if I want to take it out because... And like cut it down to fit inside my holding two weeks. I don't know if I want to do that. I want to take this out too and see if maybe I want to use this... Um, oh, it's really stuck to this. What in the world? Oh, man. Ooh, what is going on here? Okay, there it comes. I want to get this book lover sticker out. Because I'm thinking about sticking that down somewhere. Maybe this coffee one, too. Because coffee is life. And I don't have any coffee stickers in my planner yet. And I'm like... <laughs> back in here. See if there's anything else that I want to stick in there. I think I'm going to put my health tracker in here. I might use that one too. I really like this one too. Not me like totally taking apart my personal rings planner <laughs> for a new setup, but it's okay. It's kind of like semi setup still. Because I think I'm going to leave everything the way that it is. Because I like how it's set up. Um, I kind of want to use this one too. Ah, okay, let's go put that away for now. But I wanted to pin these two down together. Like there. Maybe I'll stick this like... Oh my god, that's so cute. Oh my goodness, that is adorable. I think I'm going to leave that there. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'll stick it here. Oh my gosh, it would be so cute right here too. This is gonna be a long video. A long video. Oh, I love that. That is so cute too. Okay, so since I am done with these tabs, I need to use this monthly when I go get my other um, washi tape. I kind of want to put this sticker. Oof, I don't know. Oof, I don't know. I don't know if I want to make this sticker permanent too. Because I love that evil eye sticker. But I don't know. I don't want it to be like too many words going on here. I was thinking about sticking it down here. But I don't know just leave it alone for now I just wanted to at least like get my tabs on camera um a setup here with you guys oh I love how these all came out I want to kind of take a picture like this and then post it on Instagram 
because this is all Planner Monkey Co's stickers or yeah washi tape stickers when you know you know like when you know you love a, a planner shop you stick with it I'm gonna take a picture like that oh my gosh that would be so cute I think I'm gonna do that and then now I have my tabs going on I also explained how I'm gonna start this planner early and I'm excited for that. This is my note pages. I don't know if I want to put anything here yet. I might put like cute stickers on here, but I know I wanted to keep it more simple compared to last year. Like last year, I went like super crazy with all the stickers. But you know, as a year comes on, I don't, I, obviously I'm not gonna go all like in right now, but like as a year like goes on, I might end up Actually, I wanted to use these on here too. Um, I might end up like sticking more stuff down. So who knows? It's just fun to play with planners. But yeah, like here, you see how I decorated it? I like put this here. I put this sticker down. I put this whole like 90s collage here, which I love. And I love this whole setup, this whole planner. It was such a mood. But for now, I feel like I just want to like chill on chill out <laughs> on um stickers for now and like de overly deck not overly decorating it but you know, you guys know what i mean i just don't want to go too far in right now i just want to keep it simple clean and yeah i'm just gonna stick this here because this is probably where I'm gonna start it. So I'll just place that there. I'm gonna put monthly there. And then the weekly, I will just stick right here where I'm gonna more than likely start it. Um, let me stick this in the back for now. That's that one. If you're wondering where I got these d dividers, these are from Type A for Alexa. These are my old ones that I bought for 2021's planner. But I am just going to stick them in here because I really, really love these dividers. Um, might take them out, might keep them in, who knows. But for now, I really want them in here. There we go. So that is how my 2024 planner is coming out. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Um, I feel like this video is going to be a long chatty one with you guys and I'm sure you guys are here for it, but yeah, that is going to be the end of my video and I hope you guys enjoyed this. I do enjoy, um, or I do enjoy, <laughs> I do enjoy, yeah, actually I do. I do enjoy filming these videos for you guys when I can. Um, but I also appreciate you guys watching them and leaving comments on them and all of that. Like I enjoy it. I might take forever to get back to them. But I am sure to respond to all of you guys um, as quickly as I can. And yeah, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. And appreciate you guys watching again. And I will just chat with you guys in my next video. Bye.